ഡി സ്റ്റുഡൻസ് വെൽക്കം ടു ബോസ്കോ ക്യാമ്പസ് വിഷൻ ദ യൂട്യൂബ് ചാനൽ ഓഫ് കുട്ടിയം ഡോൺ ബോസ്കോ കോളേജ് ഐ എം റാണിയർ അസിസ്റ്റൻറ്റ് പ്രൊഫസർ പോസ്റ്റ് ഗ്രാജുവേറ്റ് ഡിപ്പാർട്ട്മെൻറ്റ് ഓഫ് ഇംഗ്ലീഷ് ഇൻ ദിസ് ലെക്ചർ സീരീസ് ഐ എം ഡീലിംഗ് ദ പേപ്പർ ലാംഗ്വേജ് സ്കിൽസ് ദിസ് ഈസ് എ ട്വൽത്ത് ലെക്ചർ ഓഫ് ദ പേപ്പർ ഇൻ ദിസ് ലെക്ചർ ഐ വുഡ് ലൈക്ക് ടു ഇൻട്രോഡ്യൂസ് സെർട്ടൻ ആക്ടിവിറ്റീസ് ബേസ്ഡ് ഓൺ സെക്കൻഡ് മൊഡ്യൂൾ first one is for enriching your vocabulary vocabulary or word power helps you to master english language and its different skills so try to find out the meaning of these words with the help of a dictionary vocabulary enriching vocabulary is an important thing in language learn so do it next one is rhyming words so we have already learned certain poems and from or in all these poems carry certain rhyming words so what is rhyming words rhyming words are words that end with similar sounds for example take fake make all these three words end with ke so these words are rhyming words and here is a list of words find out the words that rhyme with the following with these words so next one is synonyms and antonyms so these two are also part of vocabulary so synonyms are words with same meaning for example for the word old ancient is a synonym of the word old because old and ancient have same meaning so synonyms are those words with same meaning and in the case of antonyms antonyms are words with opposite meaning okay so for the word old new is the antonym and here is a list of words are provided try to find out the synonyms and antonyms of these words next one is identify the vowel sounds so you have already learned the sounds in english language we have 44 phonemes and 20 vowel sounds and 24 consonant sounds so here i am giving a list of words try to identify the vowel sounds in this list and underline the sound only vowel sound only next one is how to find out the number of syllables this thing you have already learned in the previous class so in order to find out the number of syllables in a word first thing you have to do is you have to count the vowel sounds in that word so you can find out the number of syllables by counting its vowel sounds if there is a there is a diphthong treat is a treat it as a vowel sound and count it as one so that you can easily find the syllables number of syllables in a word so as i mentioned in the last class vowel sound is the nucleus of a syllables so that you you can easily find the number of syllables by counting its vowel sounds okay so next one is preparing interview questions when you prepare interview questions make a study of the celebrity then only you can approach the celebrity with your question so try to make a detailed study of your guest or the celebrity and then only you have to start asking your questions and you can include subjective questions like uh, what are the interest of the uh, of the personality or the what are the interest of the given figure 
और वट इज हिज वट अबाउट हिज पर्सनल लाइफ लाइफ पर्सनल लाइफ फैमिली लाइफ बट डोंट एक्स डोंट शूट आउट एक्सट्रीम पर्सनल क्वेश्चन दैट इज एन इम्पोर्टेंट थिंग एंड वेन यू प्रिपेयर ए क्वेश्चन एयर फॉर एन इंटरव्यू यू कैन इंक्लूड क्वेश्चन ऑन देयर इंटरेस्ट देयर रोल मॉडल एंड फ्यूचर प्रोजेक्ट सपोज इट इज अ फिल्म इट इज अ पर्सन फ्रॉम फिल्म इंडस्ट्री यू कैन आस्क अबाउट हिज फ्यूचर प्रोजेक्ट योर रोल मॉडल एक्सेट्रा ट्राई टू मेक द क्वेश्चन lively so all these things are impo- very important in framing interview questions so my dear students in this lecture i had discuss certain activities i had introduced certain activities especially the activities to improve your vocabulary try to write down all these activities and send me through whatsapp here i am giving an assignment question also do it as your homework and send me through whatsapp thank you have a nice time